Mint. So we're using, uh, I'm using the XFCE Mint, and I'm sure there are similar ones in other window managers you might be using. Anyway, so down here, here's the button for Places, and that brings up a window of places that you have, like, you know, desktop file system, my home directory. Let's open that guy up, because that's going to open up the window. There we go. Uh, that says, here's the directory where all my files are. Now I want to connect to the CS server. I'm like, all right. So I just went up here and I said go, and open location, and this bar just lit up saying, oh, you can type whatever you want in here. Now you can type any folder that's on your computer, you know, just jump into that folder like I could just type in documents, and it even auto-completes because it's so smart and puts it there. But what I really want to do is I want to open that location. I'm going to type in ssh colon slash slash as if kind of looks like I'm going to a website. And I'm going to say msherman at cs.uml dot edu because that's me at the server. Now what this will do is I hit enter on it and this is going to connect to that server with SFTP to do secure transfer. So I'm going to put my password in here and I'm going to connect. Now there's one thing that I wish I, it did better and that is where it dumps me is in the root of the server. So here's the root file system of the server, which is like not useful. This is not my home directory. Uh, so I need to know where my home directory is. Uh, I'll just pop open a terminal emulator real quick. This is sad that this has to happen. But you know, it's not bad. It's not bad. So I'm going to SSH into the server here just to find out where my home directory actually is. So here I am, I'm on CS2 and I'm going to do print working directory. That's where I am. User CS grad doc M Sherman. That's where my user directory is. Yours will probably be different because you are not CS grad doc M Sherman. Uh, so I'm just going to actually copy and paste this. Right up into here. I thought that would paste. There we go. Use uh, If you highlight and middle click in Linux, it will paste whatever you have highlighted when you middle click, which is nice. Um, so let's try that. Loading folder contents, there it is, and there's my stuff. There we go, easy enough. Now if I had typed this in to begin with, uh, when I hit connect to, it would have come right up to this folder and I never would have seen the root, which is pretty neat. Now what's cool about this is I can now open a new window And here in my documents on my system, so here I am, local, home, mark, documents. There's the linked list we've been working on. I want to come over here to the server, go in my computing one folder, and I'm going to drag the linked list right into here. Oh, there's already one called linked list. I should be careful. So I'm going to open this up. Uh, I'm going to go up one more. Let me find a different folder for it. I'll just toss it in here and fix it later. So I can just grab the linked list and drag it over. What? Come on. I did not test this before making the video. There we go. Now it's copying. And that's actually copying over to the server. And bam, it's there. I can validate that. I can go in here and look at it. And there it is. Linked list. There we go. That's pretty cool.